Hello, this is Kinky, uh, doing part 9 of Let's Play Blaster Master. Uh, I, I apologize for uh, going in the wrong door again, but I figured that I, I would just kind of show off some of the levels and some of the different uh, gameplay designs that they did for level 4. Uh, unlike the other levels, level 4 is kind of has a uniqueness to it that uh, each each door has its not only its own part but they're all linked together. Uh, I kind of find that kind of trippy. <laughs> uh, but basically, if you notice the path path all around you on the sides there, that was that north door that we went in in, in uh, part eight. <laughs> I kind of found that kind of like a neat feature. I figured I'd show it off. Uh, also, if, if this for those guys, uh, you don't need max gun for them. Just I prefer having max gun around. But uh, if you are versing them, use a single shot. That works too. I mean. The low, 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 low gun upgrade of level three, I believe it is. That'll and that'll kill them pretty quick too. Uh, like I said, you can shoot the bullets, but the wavy bullets kind of make them harder to hit. Uh, I've been having a little bit of trouble, uh, kind of. Uh, Like I said, I was kind of worn out and kind of troubled uh, last night. Kind of had a late night and uh, got a little bit tired. Uh, I, you know, I was running around all over the place. Uh, my, my toilet broke, so I had to replace it, get it fit, or not replace it, I mean replace a part to it and get it fixed. Uh, I was kind of playing like an all-nighter or something kind of thing, and some other games to uh, see how uh, Basically, this hover section is near where the boss area is, and as you'll notice, like I said, getting hit is no problem. They, they have key all over the place. I think it kind of nerfs the difficulty of it. I mean, having the landmines and sneaky locations just off-screen is it was kind of a cute little challenge to it, but then having all these mobs that drop power kind of killed what difficulty it had, which was kind of sad. Um, also, for this, for the total OP, uh, the death count has increased by one, so we're now at, uh, I believe, either three or four total deaths. Uh, could, I accidentally deleted the uh, test recording of her when I died, uh, but it was due to uh, old foginess of uh, forgetting how to fight the boss. Uh, and I tried to do a kamikaze run to see if I can die again, and get recorded in a video for uh, Chameleon, because I know she asked me to show off the. Uh, Death animations, uh, for some strange reason. Uh, also, our buddy from World One sh shows here for like two seconds. And there he was. <laughs> really wish they would show that guy more often, because he's like my, he, out of all the enemies in Master Blaster, he's like my favorite one, because he's like appears like. I mean. It's just the poor guy's unappreciated. Um, I cut the video there because I thought I was at like six minutes or whatnot, and I was gonna do a split for one getting to the boss and one uh, fighting the boss itself. But I noticed it was four minutes, so I kept going. Uh, also about the Japan disaster thing, uh, I have a friend who. Who's in like Melbourne, Australia, or whatnot? 
uh, she actually had planned to uh, visit her friend in Tokyo like two days before her flight to Tokyo. Uh, and so she was worried sick about her friend. Uh, and I really failed at trying to comfort her. Um, I mean, uh, I really don't know how to comfort somebody with that kind of situation going on because uh, I, I know that like the power she said her friend had like limited power, so uh, so it's like I'll only talk to her like in a prince moment and then that's it. And I know that cell phones are limited and they have the radiation. Uh, I know, like, for the Americas here, the pilots' unions debating on going to Australia, making flights to, to uh, Japan or not, due to the radiation. So, I, I, I would have no idea how the heck I would be able to help my friend if I was in her situation. So, I, I kind of feel stuck and, you know, kind of how to comfort her, because... Uh, I I don't know what she can really do to help her friend. Um, I mean, I get that she's worried sick and whatnot, but I mean, I really don't know how how that she could help. Uh, but I figured I would kind of give a shout out to uh to her. Uh, her name is Arle. Uh. Uh, she's a friend I met on Fez and whatnot, but uh, uh, she, but she, she's kind of mad at me for uh, some reason. I'm kind of going through a loneliness streak myself, uh, and I, I think that she kind of misunderstood what I was meaning, and that. I get that she was worried sick about her friends, but uh, at, the, at the same time, too, it's, I, I haven't seen, I only like see her like once every two weeks or something like that. I mean, here, here get a message from her, and I was I kind of was letting her know, hey, you know, I, I don't hear from you as much either, you know, you can kind of talk to me more, I would kind of like to talk to you sometime, uh, and kind of having no one around to talk too much, and kind of get boring after a while, and kind of having a lonely streak going, so, uh, I mean, I wasn't trying to say, you know, like, oh, stop, stop worrying about that, go, go focus on me or something, I, I was just kind of saying, hey, I miss you a lot, and I'm some company and someone to talk to and you kind of look like you're worried after that and um, I know that talking out problems kind of helps you know uh, comfort at least for me anyway it helps comfort me when I get when I can talk out my problems um, so and I think that she kind of misunderstood what I was meaning uh, by I, I mean I, like I said, I, I get her side of it, she's worried sick, but I also get to, uh, I think she got a hold of her, and there's uh, nothing that um, she can really do at the moment to all do the situation, and uh, at, least, at least be happy that she's okay, and you know, just uh, be patient. Is kind of what I, what I was trying to tell her, and I think she, like I said, I think she got the message wrong and she exploded on me. So I kind of dedicate this video to an apology to her. Uh, anyway, this this here is the fog boss. Uh, I apologize for the length, but this is my second attempt on this boss. I was kind of a little bit more patient this time around because uh, the first time I went in full guns blazing and uh, realized, oh yeah, I, I have to remember how the bosses work. <laughs> but 
basically this boss has three attacks. Uh, one is its tongue, one is where it shoots like three little balls, and then the last one is like this one really really super fast fireball that does two damage. The little super fast fireball is what killed me because I hadn't had the timing down for how to dodge it. Uh, Max Gun is of course recommended because he has armored plating. It basically means his entire body is considered wall other than when he opens his mouth. Uh, and since Max Gun goes through walls, you, you get why I would recommend that. The other method is if you want to go kamikaze, is just like spam nades right when he opens his mouth if you can get it aimed right uh, and you'll take a lot of hits though from like this fireball attack or whatnot but it, it'll kill him quick if you just mash the grenade button right at his mouth uh, so that's another way of beating him uh, I was doing a third I did a third run through of the boss just kinda to see if there was a quicker method of madness to him and just kind of to see if I can get a death animation for uh, Camellia because she wanted to see me die on film. <laughs> and I deleted the record, my first run of the boss because I was too tired and forgot all about it. So I apologize. Uh, But this boss drops uh, the key item. Yes, that's the actual name of the item. It's called key. It has one use, and well, actually two uses in the entire game. And from there, it's never used again, which is kind of sad. I don't get why they did that. Uh, I I get that it's good premise, so I like the premise of what that key does. Is just they could have used it a bit more uh, but that'll be a wrap for this video uh, Kinky signing out, thank you